Hi guys, this is Sarah from The Savvy Professor, and in today's video, I'll discuss the differences between DigitalOcean and Linode. Watch till the end to know the final verdict on which is better. But first, let's start with the differences. So the main difference between them is their infrastructural capabilities. DigitalOcean comes with inbuilt content delivery networks. Therefore, using DigitalOcean resources as a cloud infrastructure gives you extra spaces to store your sites to store your site's static assets and cache them accordingly. On the other hand, Linode doesn't have a built-in functionality to store your site's static assets. To run a website on Linode properly, you must buy storage and cache services from another cloud service vendor or integrate your own. Therefore, DigitalOcean has a more capable infrastructure for scaling a website's performance than Linode. Performance DigitalOcean's performance is reputable as it runs on top-grade hardware. With enterprise-class SSDs and built-in content delivery networks, websites hosted on DigitalOcean load faster than competitors. On the other hand, Linode is equally fast but not like DigitalOcean. While Linode runs on Intel E5 processors and native SSDs, it lacks content delivery networks. Therefore, web pages hosted on Linode load slower than on DigitalOcean. Therefore, DigitalOcean is a faster virtual private server with the best response time. Pricing DigitalOcean's pricing covers virtual machines, Kubernetes, fully managed databases, object storage, block storage, and load balancers, with the cheapest service starting at $4 a month. On the other hand, Linode pricing categories are storage, databases, networking, and services. While Linode's cheapest price is $1 a month, it offers a price estimator you can use to calculate the total you must pay for all the services rendered to you. That is not the case with DigitalOcean, where you must contact sales for the best plan. Note that these prices may change at the respective vendor's discretion. Therefore, Linode has a more straightforward pricing model to help users get to work immediately. But do they have any similarities? Yes, they do. DigitalOcean and Linode are more similar in what they both lack than offer. For example, the two hosting solutions do not provide web hosting control or an SSL certificate. Nevertheless, they come with automatic backup services to ensure you don't lose your digital assets. To sum it up, which is better, DigitalOcean or Linode? I like DigitalOcean because of its built-in content delivery network and blazing fast speeds. I like Linode too for its straightforward pricing model. However, I don't find it a good option for web hosting. DigitalOcean is the clear winner because it has advanced infrastructure and handles heavy workloads fast. Feel free to check out the products from the links in our description. Thanks for watching. Till next time.